come yet. Don't come yet. Wait till the door is like open. They can run inside. Why the camera's moving? No. Shoot the thing. You might. Yes. Who the fuck is that by my door? Who the fuck is that? Oh, who is that? No one. Uh, you play games with me? Huh? Talk to me again, see what happens. That's no one. That's no one. I don't see anybody. It's gonna be no one that's gonna be whooping your butt with a belt. All right, keep playing with me. Act like I can't see your ass. Who is that? And why is you by my door? Yes. Wait, don't come yet. Don't come yet. Wait till the door is, like, open. They can run inside. Shalom, shalom. Call her law. Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. That's giving all praise to the Most High. In name of His only begotten Son. In name of the Holy Spirit. My name is Ibar from the Prophets in Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who taught us His truth. In truth and sincerity, peace and salutations to the hopeful elect scattered abroad. What you just seen on the screen was a post from IUIC, California. Okay, and as you see, there's a little girl. Okay, well, really a young woman. Okay, she's obviously at that age where she's trying to sneak boys in the house. That who she's trying to sneak in the house was a boy. Okay, and she's probably, you know, in middle school or whatever, you know, but, you know, it's funny because IUIC posted this and IUIC is known for calling men rapists and pedophiles for teaching the scriptures uh, regarding to, you know, when your child, OK, turns 12 years old, your child is now an adult. OK, according to the law, your child is now uh, uh, going to be held according to the law. That's why when Yahweh Shai turned 12, he was in the temple, you know, and then when his parents asked where he was, he said, don't you know that I must be about my father's business? Why? Because at that point he became an adult. You see, you got these emotional men in Israel that slander men, not even realizing the, the, the truth of the matter, you know, or they, they get emotional. OK, talking about well, my daughter, my daughter. Well, listen, your daughter, if she's not taught properly and if you're not a, a, a true father over your daughter, she's going to end up getting pregnant by one of the boys in her classroom, man. There's a reason why in the, in the ancient times and even, you know, still to this day in the, in, over there in the uh, Middle East. You know, they married daughters off young, okay? Because once a daughter go, uh, go, um, uh, um, comes to the flower of her age, which means her cycle, she gets her period, you know, she can be easily misled, okay, or easily led to doing something that's, that, that's going to destroy her body, okay? And once uh, a, 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 a young woman loses her virginity, whoever she loses her virginity to is her husband, okay? You got grown ass men over here and, 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 and you know, teaching the IUIC and, 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 and these, you know, um, splinter camps from IUIC, like no cap. And I used to be a part of those guys. And they was all, you know, they, they couldn't understand this. They couldn't understand how, you know, they'll get emotional about it. But the truth of, of the matter is, if your daughter is not, you know, get, you know given to a, a man of understanding, it's why you have some called 16 and pregnant, man. OK, and his father, he's this is how he found out that his daughter you know, it's how he found out about his daughter. You see, you have to watch with, a, with an impudent eye. Okay. So let's grab the scripture right here. This is the book of Sirach, chapter 7, verse 23. Has, has thou children? Instruct them and bow down their neck from their youth. You know, you got to teach your children at, uh, from their youth, man. Okay. And, and then at the same time, you know, us coming into this truth, we have to be taught, man. You have to be taught according to the ways of the Bible, not according to or your only feelings or your own emotions, man. You know, at the end of the day, you have to train your children, you know, properly, man. You know, let them know what it is and what it ain't. They need to know about, you know, these scriptures, man. Verse 24. Hast thou daughters? Do you have daughters? Okay. Hast thou daughters? Have a care of their body. You see, so you can't let your, let your daughters go out wearing any, anything. You can't let your daughters, you know, be hanging around anybody because what they're going to, you know, find themselves in a, in a, in a situations, man. 
And before you know it, you got to, you know, raise kids when no, your daughter got kids and don't know who the father is, man. OK, this is going on. But you got guys saying that, oh, yeah, you're not a, 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 an adult until you're 18. That's what Esau taught you, man. That's not according to, to the Bible. That's not biblical. Once a child turns 12 years old, it is no more that 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 is no longer a child. It's a young adult. OK. It's a young adult. Once you hit puberty, you are a young adult and then your body starts changing. You see. And what you think this little girl is going to sneak this little boy into the house to do? Huh? Play checkers. Play fucking, uh, 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 you know, uh, you know, watch Barney or something, man. You know, you have to be realistic in this thing. And a lot of guys are not men. You know, the Lord says, show yourselves men. And a part of showing yourselves men is understanding, you know, um, order, you know, to, to understand how things work, to understand these scriptures. Okay, you can't be emotional, man. It says, hast thou daughters, have a care of their bodies and show not thyself cheerful toward them. Marry thy daughter. What does it say? Marry thy daughter. And so shalt thou have performed a weighty matter. If you let your daughter wait till she 18, uh, uh, however uh, oh, long, you know. Now, obviously, you have to according to the system. We're not in our kingdom. But nonsense out of 10, if your daughter waits that long, she's going to have multiple sex partners by the time she's 18. Okay? You, you, you got, you know, these, these young girls... You know, first of all, a woman was created to have children, okay? These women were not created to go to college and, you know, uh, uh, to, to be a fucking realtor. You were created to, you know, to, to, be, to be with a man, to bear children and take care of a household. So the moment they become women, you know, their body is telling them, okay, it's time to have a baby. It's time to have a baby. It's time to have a baby. Even if they're not physically trying to have a baby, they get hot. You know, you probably call them fast, fast little girls. Well, those fast, ass little girls are really young women, you see, according to the scriptures. There was no 18 years old, you know, in, in ancient time, man. It's not it's not realistic. And, you know, I might get some slack for this video. You might have a bunch of emotional, you know, demons coming on this video. But at the end of the day, the truth must be declared, man. You see, this is how you take care of households. OK, this is how you create households. OK, and not single uh, parents and bastard children. OK, it says verse 25, marry thy daughter. And so shalt thou have performed a weighty matter. Give, but give her to a man of understanding. You see, so if you have a daughter, you have to marry her off, and that's why you have some called, you know, Jake's emotional now, man. You have some called a dowry, where the father was would pretty much marry the daughter off, and he would sell her to a man of understanding, a man of substance, and it was usually an older man, because a younger man is not going to have understanding or, or substance. You see, it says, "Hast thou a wife?" After thy mind, forsake her not, but give not thyself over to a light woman. Okay? And you got men out here that, you know, are emotional, you know, and, and it's all about their feelings instead of just going, dealing with the truth, man. Dealing with the truth. Let's grab this. Look at this. This is um I'll get right to the point. Ecclesiasticus or Sirach chapter 42, verse 9. It says, The father waketh for the daughter when no man knoweth, and the care for her taketh away sleep. When she is young, lest she pass the flower of her age, meaning she's coming to her period, and being married. Lest she should be hated. So, you know, at the end of the day, you know, marriage is sex. Okay. So once so in the ancient time, once a, once a, young, once a young woman would plat, once a young girl would pass the flower of her age, she became a young woman and the father would marry her off. Why? So she doesn't go out there and destroy herself. You see? By sleeping with some random man and she don't even know his fucking name and he's gone and she's pregnant and nobody knows who the, who the father is. Or sleeping with more than one man and nobody knows who the father is. You see? A woman being a virgin is a very important thing in our custom, man. Okay, this is a very important thing because when a woman was a virgin, that means that she was a young woman of maritable age. But once she lost her virginity, she she has already been married. Well, you have such adulterous, you know, this is such an adulterous generation because why? You got women that have multiple sex partners, man. By, by, when they, when they, by the time they're 12, 13, 14 years old, they're having children, you know. They having sex, sneaking man inside the house. 
Ecclesiastes chapter 42, verse 9. And a lot of men who have who may have daughters or children, you know, they get emotional about this and they don't want to think about it. But this is the reality, man. And as a man, you have to deal with reality. OK, men can't afford to be, you know, emotional or, you know, um, uh, men can't afford to be emotional or, um, you know. It says it, uh, the father waketh for the daughter when no man knoweth. So the father is always watch. He has he, you got to watch over your daughters, man. You know, you know, the father waking up in the middle of the night to make sure nobody in his house, make sure the daughter's still in the room. You see, that's the, that, that's the role of a father if he has a daughter. It says, the care of her taketh away sleep. I had a man, you know, break the scripture down to me all wrong. Couldn't have no understanding, man. And the same guy was emotional. If, well, if I have a daughter, if I have a, it's not about your fucking daughter. Stop getting emotional, man. Do a reality. The care of uh, for her taketh away sleep when she is young. You see, when she is young, lest she pass away the flower of her age. Okay, because, hey, if you have a daughter, you have to watch out for your daughters, man. Make sure that, that, that nobody, you know, try, try, trying to touch or molest your, 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 your daughters. Now, you know, your sons too, but it's more likely, you know, with, with, with your daughters. You know, and it says, lest she pass the flower of her age. Because once she passes the flower of her age, she is an adult now. It's, it's, it's that time. Okay, and if and, 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 and if uh uh, you know these guys are gonna be emotional, but if a young you know uh, a woman, you know, at uh you know maybe twelve, thirteen, fourteen years old was was not a young woman, then why can't she have a baby at that age? Why can't she get pregnant and have a baby at that age? Okay, that's the Lord telling you. And when she when a woman gets when a young girl gets her period, that's the Lord telling her she has now become a young woman. Okay, and I remember the the, the uh, Good Time show when I believe her name is Ruby or, or whatever the little girl's name was. When she got her period, her that was her mother. Her mother told her, "This is you becoming a young because this means that you are now a young woman." Okay, you guys been in Babylon too long. You too too emotional. It says when she is young, lest she take lest she pass the flower of her age, and being married, lest she be hated, in the virgin in her virginity, lest she should be defiled. And okay, Slocky, let me go back. It says, lest she be hated. Now, why would she be hated? Huh? And she gets pregnant and doesn't know who the father is. Now, her father has to take care of her. She in her father's house with, you know, somebody else's baby. She's not going to get married. She, you know, because once a woman, you know, that's why you had something called when, you know, uh, when, when a marriage did take place, the, the father, I mean, the men would go into the woman and then he would have to go back down and show the ceremony was he would go back down and he would show, you know, the congregation, the bloody sheets. Proving that she was a virgin, meaning that she wasn't already married to anybody. You see, but if those sheets don't ble bleed, meaning that she, she has already been, she has already had her hymen, you know, her, or they say her cherry popped, okay, which means that you know, she, you know, that, that she's already been, she has been defiled, okay. So it says, and being married, lest she should be hated, in her virginity, lest she should be defiled and gotten with child in her father's house. And this is what this man was, was going through right here. What you saw in this video. His daughter was almost about to get, you know, with child in, inside her father's house. You know, which is an embarrassment to the family. Okay, in her virginity, lest she should be defiled and gotten with child in her father's house. And having a an husband, lest she should misbehave herself. So it's why you, why you women got married off young. And, and if you go to the Middle East, if you go back to Israel, to our land, they're still doing that over there, man. They're still doing that over there. Okay. And a, and a man can have more than one wife. That's how every woman gets a husband. And not just sleeping around on OnlyFans and shit, man. It says, and when she is young, lest she pass away the flower of her age. Oh, so like I already read that part. Lest she be, uh, lest she misbehave herself by what? Going out and being, you know, sexual. It says, and when she is married, lest she should be barren. Okay. So at the end of the day, man, oh, I'm going to keep on reading. It says, keep a sure watch over a over a shameless daughter. And you see, oh, that's why this man got this camera right here, man. And if you got a daughter, watch your daughters, man. You know, you have to watch over your daughters. That's, the, that's, the, that's why yeah, I ain't trying to have no daughters, man. <laughs> you know, that, that's why it's an honor to have, to, have, to have sons, really. You know, because if, you know, if, you know, your, your daughter can go out there and, and have a child by a heathen or some fucking bum, you know, some, you know, loser. 
But a son, you know, if you raise your sons right, then if he, they have children, those children are going to be raised according to, to, to the father, man. Now, you know, the scriptures also, we read earlier, it says, give not that stuff to a light woman too now. So you can't, so you don't just have babies, you know, children with any, with any type of woman. Because you got light women out here, women of no understanding, no demons. It says, keep a, she keep a sure watch over a shameless daughter, lest she make thee a laughing stock to thine enemies. You see? Because what? Your, your, your daughter can, can go out there and uh, get pregnant by one of your enemies, man. Because let, lest you make thee a laughing stock to one of thy to thine enemies and a byword in a city and a reproach among the people and make thee ashamed before the multitude. Because what that, that what that means is that you wasn't watching over your, your, your uh, daughter. You know, if your daughter come back home and she's pregnant at 12 years old, 13, 14, that means that you wasn't watching over your, uh, your, your uh, daughter, man. You see? You wasn't raising her properly. It says, um, verse 12, Behold not every body's beauty, and sit not in the midst of women. For from garments come a moth, and from women wickedness. And these young girls, you know, the yeah, amen, they get hot down there, you know. And then, you know, they start, you know, talking to boys at school. They start liking boys, and then the young boys... You know, they reach that certain age too, where they, you know, trying to, exp you know, it, it, um, where, 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 where they trying to, uh, how you say it, um, they're trying to experiment, you know, and you know they're not thinking about marriage. <laughs> Obviously, they're only like, you know, in, in middle school, so you know they don't understand that, you know, and when so once a once a woman or a young girl has had sex with multiple men, she is destroyed, man. That destroys a young girl. Okay. And you can't be emotional about this, man. This is a part of teaching the Bible. You screw the Lord, say, eat the whole roll. You can't just push, you know, you know, peel, 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 peel the crust off. You can't just, you know, you got to eat, you know, eat all your veggies. You, you know, like El Apostol Hart said it in the last campus video, I believe. He said how, um, you know, when you, you, was, you was a kid, your parents told you you couldn't go outside or play your game until you ate all your veggies. You couldn't leave that table until you ate all your veggies, man. Meaning what? You got You can't just eat the good, but you got to take the bad too. Or you can't just deal with the easy. You got to deal with the hard too. God's talking about they only deal with the milk. You got to go into this meat too, man. That's a part of being a teacher of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Being an ambassador, a messenger of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And the Lord said what? Um, uh, uh, blessed are those that are not offended in me. Certain guys get offended at these topics and call men rapists that have never raped nobody, man. We, we just tell you how to raise your fucking kids, man, according to the scriptures. You see? It says, 1 Corinthians chapter 7. Hmm. I'm going to go to verse 36. It says, but if any man think himself, think he behaveth himself uncommonly toward his virgin, if she pass the flower of her age, there and no and need so require, let him do what he will, he sinneth not. Let them marry. And marriage is sex. So once a, 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 a young girl passes the flower of her age, which means her period, she gets her period, you know, according to the ancient world, hey, she, that means she's ready. You see? It says, nevertheless, he that slandereth steadfast in his heart. Ooh, oh, oh, stalking. Nevertheless, he that standeth steadfast in his heart, having no necessity, but has power over his own will and hath so decreed in his heart that he will keep his virgin doeth well. So, hey, you, you get a virgin, you know, and, and, and you take her virginity, you, you hey, that, that you, have, you have to keep her, man. You see? So then he that giveth her in marriage doeth well, but he that giveth her not in marriage doeth better. For the wife is bound by the law as long as the, as the husband liveth, but her husband do be dead. If her husband be dead, she is at liberty to be married to whom she will only in the Lord. Okay, so that's that's something else. But um, let's go here. This is uh, the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 26, verse 
going to start at verse 8. It says, A drunken woman in a gather abroad causeth great anger, and she will not cover her own shame. The whoredom of a woman is known in her haughty looks and eye legs. If thy daughter be shameless, keep her in straightly. You got to keep her in the house. You got to be watching her. You know, keep, keep, keep her on in difficulty. So you got to be strict, you know. It says, lest she abuse herself through overmuch liberty. This man that had this camera here and just let his daughter go willy-nilly, you know, doing what she want to do. She's going to abuse her, herself, you know, destroy herself through overmuch liberty, freedom. You see? It says, watch over an impotent eye and marvel not if she trespass against you. You got to watch over her, man. You got to be, you know... <laughs> That's the that's what when you have when you have a daughter, that's what's that's what happens, man. That's why they say the father keep, you know, keep, she keepeth the father up at night. Because he's making sure she ain't sneaking out or sneaking no man in the house. You see? She will open her mouth as a thirsty traveler when she had when he hath found a fountain, and drink of every water near her. By every head she will sit down and open her quiver against every arrow. Because a young girl. You know, a young girl, you know, um, you know, they, they, they call themselves liking boys, you know, at a young age. But, you know, every week it's a different boy. You see what I'm saying? So if she end up destroying herself and, and, and open herself up to those young boys or those, you know, young men, really, you know, eventually it's going to be more than one. And then she's going to, you know, she 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 she, she won't be in the bathroom, you know, and, 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 you know, hey, those of us that's not that old, you know, we, we remember that, man. We remember being in school and you hearing stories about girls getting uh, trains ran down with one of them in the bathroom. And if you're too old to know what that means, that means when a woman uh, is, is, is having sex with multiple men, you know, one in the front, one in the back. That, that, that's what was happening. And, and that's, what, that's what was happening in school, man. You know, or you would see girls, you know, that you I was in your fucking class. You still a virgin, but she getting picked up by grown ass men. You see. It says the grace of the wife delighteth her husband, but in her discretion will fight fat in his bones. That's the point. Um, so that's the you know that's pretty much the point, man. Okay, I pretty much read read it all. Um. Let me see. Let's grab this. This is what the Lord wants for young for young women to do. It says First Timothy not to go to college. Well, you know, these women, these, these girls go to college and they over there getting you know trains ran on. They over there being whores. They go to the military and they're over there being whores. They come back pregnant and shit, man. This is this is what actually happens. A woman is not meant to be out here, you know, doing her own thing. A woman, a woman, it was created to be given to a man, okay, and to, and to take care of a household. When a man gets a woman, he has gotten a possession, okay. So if you don't want your daughter to be on, at at the strip club at fucking eighteen years old on OnlyFans, eighteen years old, hey, really, you you know, you have to you know watch over her, man. It says First Timothy chapter five, verse. I'm gonna go to. Um, verse 12 or, let, or let's go to verse 11 but the younger widows refuse for the, when they have when they have begun to wax wanton against Hamashiach they will marry ha, meaning they're going to have sex man you see these, these women you know they're hey, 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 they, they going to be here having sex okay you might say oh my, not my daughter but you don't know your daughter man Okay, your, your, your damn daughter probably getting popped in the school bathroom. It says, having damnation because they have cast off their first faith. And a lot of men that have that, you know, that, that, that's ignorant about that. You may have a daughter and while you in the bed asleep, she over there in the room getting, you know. That's that. That's the reality, man. We, it's time to be men and do a reality. It says, and with all, they learn to be idle, wandering about from house to house. You know, in, in, in every other man's bed, you, you give a, man, a, 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 a young woman liberty, she's going to be in every man's bed. It says, and not only idle, but tattlers, always gossiping and talking and shit. It says, also being busybodies. They be out there fighting. fighting. You see these young girls fighting in the middle of the street and shit. They be out there, you know, running around town, young as hell. You know, I used to work down in, um, you know, pretty much in, in the city, Ybor City, where the, all the clubs at. And you have girls out there that was young, had no business out there. They'd be out there hanging out with their friends and shit. 
And sometimes they'll even still get inside the clubs, man. It says, speaking things which they ought not, you know, they will, if I will therefore that the younger women marry, okay, he's supposed to be married, he's supposed to be given to a man. You know, I will therefore that the younger women marry, bear children, guide the house, give no occasion to speak to the, uh, ad, give no occasion to the adversary to speak reproachfully for some are already turned aside after Satan. So he's saying these, you got young women out here that's turned aside after Satan doing what they want to do out here being, you know, that's why you got a show called 16 and pregnant, man. If, 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 a, uh, if a woman was a, a okay, so put it like this. Say a woman is 15 and she gets pregnant at 16 or whatever, or she has a child at 16. Is that young woman still a girl? No, because now that young girl has a, a woman responsibilities. Okay. But I just thought this was funny, man, because I, you know, I just happened to, be, I happened to go on Instagram and it was, this is on the IUIC page, man. You see, but when it comes to slandering and, 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 and uh, you know, going against men, you know, these guys can't see, can't see, man. And like I said, you can't be emotional, man. Okay, you can't be emotional. You have to deal with the truth, you know. So I pray this is edifying to the for elect. I'm going to make it too long. You, 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 uh, you know, you, you, you uh, get the picture, you see. And, uh, you know, this is only for the elect, man. This truth at the end of the day is only for the elect. Everybody else is going to talk shit. They, they ain't gonna, they're not going to be able to understand, okay? This is only for the elect. So with that being said, I'm going to say Shalom, Kwame Sharala, Abba, Abba, Abba. I'm going to play this video again so it, it, it'll solidify what this, you know, girl was about to do when, when this little boy got, got in her house and her father caught her. This shows you the scriptures is real. The scriptures is true. And all the scriptures I just brought out prove that. But these other camps that talk about the law, the law, the law, they'll never go into these things, man. You see? So you got to beware, you know? This truth is about reality, not fake, fake, not bullshit. With that being said, I'm going to say Shalom, Kwame Sharala, Abad Babal. Oh, no. Yes. Please don't come yet. Don't come yet. Wait till the door is like open. They can run inside. So you can run inside. No. Shoot. The... Mm. You might. Yes. Who the fuck is that by my door? What? Who the fuck is that? Oh, who is that? No one. Uh, you wanna play games with me? Huh? Not talk to me again, see what happens. That's no one. That's no one. I don't see anybody. It's gonna be no one that's gonna be She's probably in the 6th, 7th grade, man. Right. Keep playing with me. Act like I can't see your ass. I was a whole little boy over there. Who is that? And why is you by my door? No, oh, a young man. Wait, for, don't you know, according don't to, to the scriptures. Wait till the door is like open. Okay. They can run inside. Let me grab this. This is uh, 2 Peter chapter 3, verse. Um, verse 7. It says, Likewise, ye husbands, you husbands, dwell with them according to knowledge, giving honor unto the wife. Yes. As unto the weaker vessel, the woman is a weaker vessel, as being heirs together uh, of the grace of life, that your prayers be not hindered. Okay, so, you know, um, the, 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 uh, a, the woman is a weaker vessel, man. The woman is a weaker vessel, and the Lord, you know, is dealing with the men. You see, so it's, 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 it's the responsibility of the men to get the women in, in the proper order, man. Okay, and to do that, you got you to stop being emotional. You have to be realistic. You see? With well, that being said, I'm going to say Shalom, Kwame Sharala, Abad, Babal. And I pray that this has been edifying to the whole for a Shalom. Oh, no, you know, Black.